Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Um, I used to say it's a sippy cup for blue. But Blue's grown up now, she doesn't take sippy cups, and she has her own Grammys. Um, first of all, um, thanks to Dr. Dre, who said he in the house, he's somewhere. Up oh, there he is. Andre Young, thank you, sir. All the doors that you opened, you know, showed us that we can be um, rock stars, seeing you on the Rolling Stone. Obviously, there's Run DMC with the Leathers and the Aerosmith, but when you came out west, you took it to a whole new level, put us on covers, Rolling Stone, put us around the world, you and Snoop, all that y'all did, all the records y'all broke, so thank you for this. Um, honored, honored to accept it, honored to accept it. And thank you to the Black Music Collective for all the work that you guys do, scholarships for young creatives, and hopefully, you know, I'm adding to, you know, what you guys are doing out here. Obviously, uh, it's, uh, it's great to have a, an award um, for such an icon. How far we've come with uh, Will Smith and them, Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince winning their first Grammy in 89 and boycotting because it wasn't televised. And then they went to like a hotel and watched the Grammys. I didn't even understand what the... <laughs> wasn't a great boycott. Um, <laughs> we're here. But then, 98, I took a page out of their book. I was nominated for the best rap album, and DMX had dropped two albums that year. They both were number one. Shout out to DMX. And he wasn't nominated at all. So I boycotted, and I watched the Grammys. <laughs> I'm just saying, we just, we want y'all to get it right. We love y'all, we love y'all, we love y'all. We want y'all to get it right, at least get it close to right. And obviously it's subjective. Y'all don't gotta clap at everything. Obviously it's, sub <laughs> obviously it's subjective because, you know, it's music and it's opinion based. But, you know, some things, you know, I don't wanna embarrass this young lady, but she has more Grammys than everyone and never won album of the year. So even by your own metrics, that doesn't work. Think about that. The most Grammys, never won album of the year. That doesn't work, you know. Some of you, some of you gonna go home tonight and feel like you've been robbed. Some of you may get robbed. <laughs> some of you don't belong in the category. <laughs> oh, no, 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 that was it. No, when I get nervous, I tell the truth. Um, but outside of that, outside of that, you know, we gotta keep showing up. And forget the Grammys for a second, just in life. As, I, as my daughter st sits and stares at me nervous as I am. Um, um, just in life, you gotta keep showing up. Just keep showing up. Forget the Grammys, you gotta keep showing up until, you, until they give you all those accolades you feel you deserve, until they call you chairman, until they call you a genius, until they call you the greatest of all time. You feel me? Thank you.